Adam gathered his courage and invited Lily to join him for a walk along the park's tranquil pathways. Hand in hand, they wandered beneath the golden hues of the setting sun, their laughter mingling with the rustle of leaves. One evening, as they sat beneath the stars, Tim poured his heart out to Lily, confessing his love in words as beautiful as the scenes he sketched. Lily smiled through tears and whispered those three magical words. I love you too, Tim. Do you also want to generate such AI animated videos? You are on the right place. In this video, I'll tell you a step-by-step -step procedure through which you can generate such AI animated videos. So without wasting more time, let's get started. So first of all, go to this website called designs.ai. I will mention the link in the description. So simply create a new account and sign up using your Google or Facebook account. So once signed up, you will see this interface where you will find so many AI tools. So in the first step, we need a script. So I have already generated a script using their AI writer tool. So basically, you need to generate a short animated story for your video. So I have already generated the script using their AI writer tool as you can see over here. So this is the first step where you need to generate the script first. Now in the second part, you have to generate images. So go to their image maker tool. Now first of all you will find some settings on the left side. If you see you will find some options like style, ratio, color and tone, lightning and composition. So if I click on style I will find so many style options over here like digital art, fantasy art, line art, pixel art, photographic and so many more. So you can select according to what kind of images you want. So as I'm going to create an animated movie I will select anime style from here. Now I will scroll down and I will select the ratio. So I will select 16 by 9 ratio because I am going to generate images for my YouTube video. Then I have to select color and tone. So here you will see so many options. I will select vibrant colors for my image. So you can select according to your preferences. Then you have to select lightning. So from here I will select sunlight because I want daylight images. So I will select sunlight. So next, just select composition, whether you want a blurry background, close up, macro photography, shots from above, wide angle or whatever kind of image you want. So once all the settings done for the image, just write the prompt to generate the image. So now I'll go back to the script and see what is my first scene about. So in the first scene, it's talking about a boy named Tim and a girl named Lily. So Tim is basically sketching in the park and Lily is singing in the rhythm of nature's melody. So this is my first scene. I will generate prompts accordingly. So this is basically a short animated love story. So I will keep this theme in my mind. So first of all, I will describe my male character. Um, so I will write minor details like brown hair, blue eyes, and he's sitting in a park and sketching. So uh, once writing the prompt, I will click on generate. So agree to these terms and click on I understand to start generating the image. So here is the result and you can see the image look absolutely stunning. So I will simply download it. Now I have to generate my female character. So I will write a prompt describing her character. So here I want an image of a young beautiful girl with blonde hair, green eyes and she is singing and dancing in a vibrant park. So rest of the settings will remain the same and I will click on generate. So here my image is ready and you can see how amazing it looks just like I wanted it to be. So I will simply download it. Now I will select the wide angle for the same prompt and I will generate this image again. So here is the result and this image also looks absolutely stunning so I will download this one as well. Now let's go back to the script and see what is the other scene about. So in the next scene it is saying that Tim is sitting beneath the shade of an ancient oak tree with his sketch pad in his hand. So let's generate this scene. So here I have written the prompt. Now from the composition I will select short from above and I will click on generate. So as you can see the image has been generated and it is a shot taken from above just as I selected and the image details are amazing. It has been generated very professionally with attention to every detail. So I will simply download it. Now let's generate another image with the same prompt so I can get two images that I can use in my video. So here is the result and this one image also looks absolutely stunning like I cannot decide which image to use in the video. Both of them are so good. 
so i will download this one as well now in the same way i will go back to the script and see what is my next scene about so that i can write a prompt about it so in the next scene tim approached lily and offered her a flower so um, basically he is giving a flower to the girl and they are standing in a park so i will write these details in the prompt and then i will simply generate my image so the image has been created and it's fascinating to see how precisely it aligns with the prompt and the scene from the story to be honest this tool has amazing capabilities in generating images so i have downloaded this image now let's go back to the script so in the next scene tim gathered courage and invited lily to join him for a walk in the park so basically they went for a walk so let's go back and generate the scene So here is the result and the image looks absolutely stunning like wow I'm in love with the results so um I will simply download it now I will generate the same image with the back side view so here is the result and I will simply download the image now I will repeat the same process and I will generate images for the rest of the scenes as well So here I have generated all the images for my story. So I generated all of these images using this anime style. So you can change the styles as well. For example, let's try selecting this comic book style and see what it generates. I will keep the prompt same. I will just change the style. So um I will click on generate. So this is the image with the comic book style and this one also looks absolutely stunning. You can use this style as well in your animated story because I absolutely love this one as well. It totally depends upon your personal preferences which style you like. Let's try another style with the same prompt. So here I will select cinematic style and I will keep the prompt same. Now let's generate and check. Simply wow, just look at the result. The image looks so beautiful. This tool actually works so well. So in this way you can generate different images using the same prompts with the different styles so all of my images are ready now let's move towards the next part now go back to their dashboard and select convert text to speech so we will use their speech maker tool to generate a voice over for our video now simply copy your script and paste it over here now select a voice over artist for your video you can also play and check hi i'm joanna and this is my voice sample Browse the list and find the voice that best suit your video. Once selected, simply click on convert. Now simply download it. So our voiceover is ready. Now in the next step, we have to generate motion effects for the images. Now for that, simply go to Runaway ML and click on start generating. Now upload your image over here. So you can also add prompts or you can use motion brush as well but I will generate without it. So after uploading the image I will click on generate. So here as you can see it has added motion effects to my image. So in this way you have to add motion effects to all of your images. Now in the last step just open any editor tool and import all of your files over here and start editing your video by compiling all of your files together. Here I'm using CapCut you can use any editor tool. So my editing is done now let me show you the final result. Once upon a time in a quaint town with a vibrant park at its heart there lived a boy named Tim and a girl named Lily. Tim found solace in sketching the world around him while Lily's heart sang to the rhythm of nature's melody. Their paths converged one sunny afternoon in the bustling park. Tim sat beneath the shade of an ancient oak tree. his sketch pad in hand when lily's laughter floated through the air like a gentle breeze entranced by her joyous spirit tim couldn't help but look up and meet her gaze with a nervous smile tim approached lily and offered her a flower he had picked on his way to the park lily's eyes sparkled with delight as she accepted the gift 
and soon they were lost in conversation, sharing stories and dreams as they strolled along the winding paths. Tim gathered his courage and invited Lily to join him for a walk along the park's tranquil pathways, hand in hand. They wandered beneath the golden hues of the setting sun, their laughter mingling with the rustle of leaves. One evening, as they sat beneath the stars, Tim poured his heart out to Lily, confessing his love in words as beautiful as the scenes he sketched. Lily smiled through tears and whispered those three magical words. I love you too, Tim. So that was it. In this way, you can create stunning AI animated stories using designs.ai. The link to the website is given in the description below. If you want a full tutorial on how to add perfect motion effects to the images, keep following my channel, I'll upload a detailed video on it. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye.